The good news is that the fire was extinguished this morning. However, the ship does continue to list slightly to its left. Navy officials say it is stable and they are optimistic it will eventually sail again. We've extinguished um, all known fires on board USS Bomber Shard. It took more than four days to extinguish the fire deep inside the USS Bonham Richard. Firefighters are now working alongside sailors who serve on board to find any lingering hot spots or hidden embers in the amphibious assault ship. Their ship is their home. It's a workplace. It's an eating place. And when we go to sea, it's the most lethal thing on the earth. 85 sailors who were living on board are now displaced and staying elsewhere on base. Initially, Navy officials were optimistic the ship would sail again. They are now tempering expectations, but remain hopeful. The, the ship can be repaired. Whether or not uh, it will be repaired uh, will be determined. Overnight, the ship started listing one way and then the other as water from the firefight started shifting. The ship is stable the way she's sitting. Uh, she has been stable the entire time, and uh, she rests very comfortably. A multi-agency investigation is underway to figure out what went wrong. The county's air pollution control district slapped a violation on the Navy for the level of pollutants that spewed into the air. Nearly 300 families took advantage of hotel vouchers offered by the Port of San Diego to escape the smell Wednesday night. The Navy and county say they are seeing air quality improve. Military investigators expect it will be a long process to figure out what went wrong and are reticent to jump to any conclusions. Still, this is the ninth fire on board a warship in the last decade. Seven were on ships undergoing maintenance, like the Bonham Richard. Over uh, the last 10 years, uh, you're going to have areas where um, errors exist. Uh, we've addressed each of those errors each, each one of those times, and uh, we've learned those lessons, um, both either from human error or from uh, equipment failure. The Port of San Diego says it is continuing to offer hotel vouchers for community members who are affected by the smoke, at least for tonight. If you're interested, you can contact National City, who is working to administer the program.